hello guys welcome back to my youtube channel my name is Bennett from gsm promit today i want to show you guys how to use the au activator only one it's a multi-functioning tool to bypass your icloud activation log on your ios devices that are running on ios 12 to 14.8 so apparently from iphone 5s to iphone x once it runs on ios 12 to 14.8 you are good to go so simply um check ring compatible devices yeah so it work on check ring compatible devices so in this video i'll show you guys how to bypass um this phone real quick without any usb or ring usb any bootable without any um <coughs> bootable ring usb it's a real quick thing before we dive into the video if you haven't subscribed yet please um do me a favor just real quick subscribe to this channel and also hit the bell icon to get notified anytime we upload the content like this so with that being said let's um move on i'll put the necessary files we'll be using in this video in the description below so you go ahead and download those files and proceed with the bypass so once you download these files they are in the format you extract them and then follow the steps in the video so the files are two we have the win ring that is to jailbreak and then the other one is to the by is for the bypass so you extract both files into separate folders as you can see in the video once the extraction is done you can go ahead and delete the zip ones if you want and then open the win ring folder to start a jailbreak you double click the win ring to launch it it will take some time to launch okay so once the win read tool launches you see some options we have check emit to boot on trusted images we have check rain um 0 0.2.4 for ios 12 to 14 jailbreak and we have check rain the last one for ios 15 to 16 jailbreak so you choose the second one because we are working on ios 12 to 14.8 and then you click on next at the down right right corner for some reasons um my buttons are not showing well but I, I don't think it will happen on your own so once you click on next it to put your device into recovery mode once the device entered in recovery you are going to go ahead and click on start to proceed with the dfu mode follow the on-screen instructions to put your device into dfu For some reasons, if your device fails to enter DFU, you can do it manually. As you can see, mine automatically boots whilst trying to put it into DFU. So you put it into DFU manually and click on next. And then click yes. So once the jailbreak is completed, you see a success message. So you go ahead and close the wind ring tool and then let's proceed with the bypass. So you open the tool folder once again and open the bypass tool. You scroll down to the bottom and select or run AU activator to
Okay, so one of the two launches, um, before we start or click on the bypass, you have to copy the um, serial number. As you can see in the down, mine is already registered. So you just go ahead and copy the serial number. The registration link will be in the description below. You can contact the developer of the tool to register and then um, he will register it for you. So the first one is GSM bypass. Let me real quick explain some of the features the tool have. We have the GSM bypass that can help you to bypass your GSM devices. That is from 7 to X. Once it runs on iOS 12 to 14.8, you can bypass with SIM working using this GSM feature. And we have broken baseband. The broken baseband is for um, broken baseband devices, probably devices that have um, non-issue. We have the MDM bypass. We have the MDM without jailbreak. So this feature will help you to bypass MDM without jailbreak. That is mobile device management lock. So you can use this feature to bypass that one. Before we have the MEID bypass, that is what we are about to do. Uh -huh. So we have the um, fixed Apple services. This feature can help you to fix all your Apple um, services after you bypass. Maybe you have issues with your Apple service like um, iMessage and the rest. And before we have OTE and Erase, OTE or Erase block. So this feature can turn off the uh, automatic update feature or it can turn off the Erase feature um, on your device. We have the USB patch. That is one of the biggest features or one of the um, imp very important features, vital feature on the tool that will help you to patch the USB accessory um, to in order to jailbreak. We have the A11 uh, erase. This will also help you to erase A11, up to A11 devices. And then um, we have the fixed bank apps too. Um, this will also help you to fix um, bank apps on your device. So let's Go ahead and click on MEID bypass to start a bypass. So once you click on MEID, that is what you are about to do. This bypass will help you to um, skip the setup, um, but signal will not function. So there won't be any SIM working or there will not be any signal after this bypass. SIM won't work apparently. Okay, so once the bypass is complete, you see the successful message. You go ahead and close it too, and then wait for the device to boot up. So once the device boots up, you can go ahead and set it up. And